Hi, I'm Matthew Coast, head dating coach and founder at CommitmentConnection.com. And today we're, we have a question from a woman in our community, and she's asking, does he really love me? So let's talk about ways to recognize whether or not a guy lo- really loves you. And so there, there's some telltale signs, some signals that a guy will give off if he really is in love with you. And here's what they are. The first one is that he initiates contact with you. So uh, if a guy's in love with you, he's going to be thinking about you a lot. And um, he may not even be able to help himself but con- end up contacting you because you'll be like, oh, man, I just like her so much. And maybe he's read some crappy dating advice that's told him not to do it. But he'll be like, oh, I'm going to contact her. you know. And so um, if he initiates contact with you, that's a great sign that uh, – that, that he might be in love with you. Um, the second one is that he expresses his love to you. And this doesn't have to be him saying it. It could be the way that he acts, right? So there's kind of a uh, really popular book out there called The Five Love Languages. And it uh, talks about the five different ways that people express love to somebody else. And one of them might be Let's go through the five real quick. The uh, first one is uh, acts of service. So if he does things for you, that could be as an expression of love. Um, another one is physical touch. So if he touches you a lot, that could be his expression of love. Um, another one is spending quality time. So if he wants to get with you one-on-one and spend quality time with you, uh, that could be his expression of love. Another one is gift giving. So if he gives you gifts, uh, that could be another way that he expresses his love to you. And the last one is is verbal, verbal, uh, so you know, appreciating you, telling you that he loves you, that kind of thing. Um, so if he expresses his love to you, there, that's a really good sign that he's in love with you. Uh, the third one is that he tries to protect you, defends you, or he takes your side, even even if you're wrong. Um, so uh, guys, when they are in love with someone they will start defending that person. They will take that person's side. They will try to protect that person because they feel like that's their role as a man is to be protective. And so if a guy's being really protective with you, then he that's a good sign that he might be in love with you as well. Um, the next one is that he wants you to meet his friends and family. And uh, don't get this mistaken with he does have you meet his friends and family because um you know some guys have friends and family that are not not very great and sometimes they're embarrassed of them and uh, they might not decide to have you meet them but if he really wants you to um and and maybe even if he is embarrassed of them he might still have you meet him anyway um so if, if he wants you to meet his friends and family that's a good sign and the last one is that he hints about uh, or he talks about having some type of future with you. So this could just be as simple as you know talking about things that he wants to do with you in the future or spending time with you in the future. Or just uh, another one is just assuming that the two of you will be together sometime in the future. That's a good hint that he is in love with you. So that's it for uh, today. If you want more information on how to attract a quality man into a committed, lasting relationship, make sure you go to my website at commitmentconnection.com and take the quiz that's there. I'm Matthew Coast, and I'll speak with you again soon.